kwa hitilafu hiyo ya mitambo. Tusonge mbele na taarifa zetu. Pesa hitajika kutoka kwa serikali tayari zimeachiliwa kuelekea vyo vikuu. Ametangaza waziri wa elimu Julius Migos. Aidha ameutetea mpango mpya ufadhili wa vyo vikuu ulioleta utata miongoni mwa wazazi. Migos akisema kuwa matatizo yanayoshuhudiwa ni ya muda tu ila lengo ni kuhakikisha kwamba kila mkenya anapata elimu ya juu bila gharama. Amezungumza katika kaunti ya Moranga wakati wa mahafali ya chuo cha ufundi cha Moranga asubuhi ya leo. By the ongoing government efforts to implement a student centered funded model which seeks to restore the financial health of universities while focusing on supporting students based on their level of need. I wish to announce that more than 130,000 first year students that were the offshoot of the 2023 Kenya Certificate of Secondary Education have already been awarded funds under the student-centered model. In total, the government has set aside 28.3 billion for loans and scholarships in this financial year for the first year students. I must admit that as for any new system, we are facing few teething problems in the process of awarding loans and scholarships with reports that some beneficiaries could have been placed in bonds that do not reflect the economic realities. Given the government's policy of leaving no one behind, I have ordered all public universities to admit students to their institutions as we process the student appeals. I have given firm instruction to the Higher Education Loans Board and the University's Fund to swiftly process the student appeals and release the results within three weeks. In the meantime, I urge all the first year students that are satisfied with the bonds that they have been placed in to move quickly and pay up their household contributions to their respective universities.